Hi guys, time for a little vlogging today. Um, I'm actually cooking for Huey right now because I want to make sure we are able to watch Game of Thrones tonight. So, um, yeah. Oh, and also, it is Charlotte's birthday. Bibs, happy birthday! So I'm cooking pork chops with peanut butter. I haven't put the peanut butter yet, but... I'll show you. And I pre-cut the vegetables. That I'm gonna put real soon. So I put the peanut butter in right now. And then I'm just gonna let the veggies steam with some rice. And then I'm just gonna be waiting for Yui. So, don't tell Yui, but I actually just bought a cheap game. It's pretty cheap though, because it's on Steam. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking about starting a second channel by myself because Yui is not a gamer and yeah, basically I'm just gonna be playing video games and I don't know, maybe some of you guys are gamer too and you're gonna like it. But the first game I might post here as well because it's a gay game. Can't wait to show you guys. Oh, taste it? Taste it? Have you completely lost your mind? Did I not tell you to let this bird man think you? If I get some sick and make Is it good? Doesn't matter. At the very least, the humanist people will. <laughs> Can you serious. please say something? He's good, but I need some salt. I made it not salty because you always complain I cook too salty. See? You can never please this guy. You couldn't do anything. So we're getting ready to watch Game of Thrones. Oh, and I put a, it's a firming mask. And I put it in my beard. Maybe I shouldn't have, it's gonna be held to rinse, but it does an awesome job. Mineral clay firming mask from Santive. Visibly firms and tighten the skin. And then after that, I'm gonna use calamine because it's gonna remove all the redness from my face. And I'm also gonna apply some to Yui's face. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Gonna put some mask on. Yeah. So now you have to talk about stuff while I'm busy applying it on you. What am I talking about? I don't know. Talk about Charlotte's birthday. I don't know. Do you have a poop story? Poop story. Or a crush on a straight guy. Have you ever had a crush on a straight guy? I did, but like a very long time ago, like when I was in like grade nine. How was it? It was, I didn't know it was a crush at the time because I didn't like come out to myself yet. Oh, so. But I remember like there was this guy in my class and like I could not stop staring at him. And I'm like, maybe I was just curious. But then later I kind of realized I kind of had like a little boner every time I look at him. <laughs> <gasps> Same happened to me. Except I had a big boner. <laughs> Dog. <Dumb, yeah. laughs> no, so basically I had this huge crush on a guy who was on my hockey team when I was really young. And I always had this crush on him. He was so tall, so hot. And he got hairy with time, which was also really hot. But then one day, 
one of my cousin, a girl cousin, came home with him and introduced him as her boyfriend. Yeah. Drama! And he was so handsome. I still can't forget about how good looking he was. And it was such a dream crushing experience to know that this guy was with my cousin. Well, just because there's a goalkeeper doesn't mean you can't score, right? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Sounds like a whore. But yeah, what what tips would you give to someone who's having a crush on a, one of their straight friends, maybe? Just move on. It's not gonna happen. You never know. Well... <laughs> Ooh, I look scary. Well, I would actually give the same tip. Because you know how you guys didn't choose to be gay. Well, I guess you don't choose to be straight either. And holding on to this is actually not gonna... And it's not healthy. It's not healthy. It's faith, false hope. Unless, well, test it out. Like, they might be curious, so go out for a couple beers. Is that Take off his pants and try to suck his dick. So Who did, <laughs> who did you do that to? <laughs> oh, I just I have a, it. I have a feeling that you did that with someone. No, I did But beef did. Do you try to turn a girl lesbian beef? <laughs> Her face is so black, she looks like she's wearing a mask too. <laughs> Happy birthday, Charlotte! Oh my god, look at her ear! Oh no! I put some mask on Charlotte's ear! No, she touched my face with her ear. Oh, it was you? Yeah. Shit. Okay, turn it up. So, how it feels? Oh, it burns a little bit. It's normal. But then you're gonna, your face gonna be more tight. Just your face, though. Oh. Is what? it cracking already? Uh. Okay guys, so we're gonna... We're gonna watch Game of Thrones now. We look like the White Walkers. Uh, we do! <gasps> oh. My lips are so pink. What you doing? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I can't. Can you make like a big expression? Go crack this shit, man. <laughs> is it crack? It did. Why is your f lips so pink? Whoa. So it left my skin pretty red. I'm gonna use calamine. So I've read that this thing, the little pink liquid, can be used as a mask and it removes all the redness on your skin. And you can leave it for quite a long time, according to what I've read. So we'll try that. You put the, yeah, like that, and then you put it on my face. So bye guys, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button to give the unicorn his horn. <laughs>